Hey everybody, welcome back to another adventure of Coffee Girl Gaming. Let's jump into this. Alright you guys, so welcome back to another adventure and we are playing Disney's Dreamlight Valley today. I love this game. I've been kind of playing it off, you know, on my own without making a video just so I can get rid of a bunch of weeds. I consider vines weeds. Oh my gosh. There's still a lot. I think that some of them actually respawn. So you can see some there. I love this game. I'm having so much fun with it. And I decided to get it on my Switch. So I don't know if you guys noticed, but I got a new little companion here in the background. And he's adorable. He's a little turtle. He kind of reminds me of Finding Nemo. And... I, I just think he's cute. So now I have two little companions. And plus I've got a whole bunch of new clothes and furniture. In fact, I have a whole new house of decorations. And I think that I might, for right now, depending on what kind of stuff we get throughout the game, I'm like, I keep wanting to switch up the way my house looks. Is that weird? Um, but I know I have a few quests to turn in. I have one for Mickey, I believe. Um... We're going to try and get a few things done today. I have Goofy and then um, we have Merlin who has a quest. So that's our goal today is to get these few quests done that we have and see what happens. I want to get inside that castle. I really do. Um, but let's go start our day. Let's go. Boy, I'm hey I'm Mickey, I know you. I'm pretty sure I have a, a task for you. How do I water crops? Okay, to water the crops, just use the watering can on the plants that are dried out. It'll help them grow. Okay, uh, let's take a look at our tasks here. For Mickey, now that you've found the recipe, it's time to bake with Mickey. Since homegrown ingredients are the best, Mickey walks you through how gardening works in Dreamlight Valley. To stop your newly planted crops from drying out, you start searching for a watering can. Having found a new tool in the village, you can use it to water your crops. Okay, so we have little check marks here. Um, Use the watering can, why, to water your crops. You have to water three crops, it looks like. And then everything else on the list we've done. So let's go water it. Um, I have a little garden here that I started to create. And so I'm super happy to have all this. We have our watering can. So let's get to watering. We just have to water three plants for Mickey, it says. That's what it says anyway. Okay, use the watering can with why to water your crops. Okay, maybe I should get some new crops out here because it doesn't seem to be working. So first of all, to create a crop, you have to use a shovel. So you have to dig first. We'll dig a couple of holes here and then you need seeds. So, all right, so we have some carrots here. So let's plant some carrots. Okay. So we have a bunch of carrots and then let's try the watering can now. Okay, I think that worked. I think Mickey liked that. All right, let's go talk to him and see if that's what he wanted. Ew. Well, coffee girl, you've sure got a green thumb. Thanks, Mickey. Gardening is so um, useful. Yeah, we can feed the whole village with the food we grow in our gardens. Well, now that you know how to garden, why don't you get some ingredients ready for a fruit salad? Apples grow all the time on the apple trees around the village. If you already picked some, you might need to wait for more to grow. But don't worry, it shouldn't take too long. And make sure to keep some of each ingredient so you'll always have something to make for your friends. I'll always keep some uh -huh. handy. That's great. I used to try to save raspberries so I could bake a pie for Vinny. <laughs> but I'd always end up eating them on my way home. Oh, Mickey. Okay, when you're ready with the ingredients, we'll make the fruit salad at your house. Oh, and don't forget to pick up the wheat you planted. Well, we have the wheat in our inventory. We have apples and we have raspberries, lots of raspberries. Okay, you guys, so this is what my house looks like now. I kind of went a little all out with the whole Buzz Lightyear kind of theme, so <laughs> it's all done. I, I, Like I said, I'll probably change it a few times, but I got all this stuff and I thought it looked cool, so I had to go with it. I had to. Um, but you know big sofa. We've got a big old TV over there. It's so cool. So 
super excited to have this all set up and now Mickey said he was gonna meet us at our house to cook but he's not here and I have nothing to cook with so I think we're gonna go to his house okay what should we do next well we need some apples and wheat to make a fruit salad and some crackers um, we can do that at your house when you're ready but my house doesn't have anything to cook and I already have wheat and apples and raspberries Thanks, pal. I'm not sure what he wants me to do but I have raspberries I, I'm pretty sure I'm probably just gonna need to get um I probably need to get something to cook on but I don't know how to get that let's see oh look at all the little friends the little companions you can have there are so many cute ones oh so we can get the squirrels as companions we probably just need to give them food okay here we go so this is where we can change our outfit and all that kind of stuff um so let's see here here's our backs so we can wear our backpacks and i'm gonna wear this cute little mini backpack tell me this isn't just the cutest thing ever which my hair is in the way but it's really cute okay let's see what else we have to wear we have some new pants we can be like buzz lightyear yeah <laughs> I don't think so but we do have some really cute clothes in here we have a costume we can wear that Mickey gave us at some overalls I still have no dresses it's not fair I have a little skirt that's kind of cute okay I don't want to wear pants with my skirt there we go okay so we have a little skirt and then for tops let's see how this looks Oh, you know what? I think we have our jersey on, so it might be under coats. Yeah. We don't need that, but what is this? Oh, it's a Pixar one. Okay, now I look kind of like schoolgirlish. I don't really know if I like that look. Let's see what else we have. That, oh my gosh, no matter what I wear, it's going to look like that. Well, if we're going to go that route, then I might go with the green. I don't know. Now we we'll go. You guys, this just isn't my normal coffee girl attire. And I bet you we don't even have cute shoes to go with it. Let's see what kind of shoes we have. No, nothing cute. We can wear Buzz Lightyear shoes. Um, We can go barefoot, which is like really weird. At least these are kind of black and white, so it matches my outfit. Um, But yeah, we have a new look. Let's see what else we have here. No jewelry. And then here, oh, we have a squirrel. <gasps> I want a squirrel following me around. That's so cute. Okay, and then for the ears, we have lots of different ears in here. We have these. We have red ears. Donut ears. We've got some turbans and scarf action going on. That kind of looks cute with my little outfits. Urgh. No, I must wear ears. I must wear my ears. We'll go with these ones because we haven't worn these yet. We don't have any mask. How about bracelets? No bracelets. And it looks like that's going to be about it. So this is what we're wearing today. Okay. I saw Goofy wandering around when I first came in the game, and I know I have a quest to hand into him because he wanted me to go fishing, and I went fishing. So we're gonna have to find him around here somewhere. We also need Merlin. We got another treasure chest right here. Cool, we got some money. And here is Goofy, so he needs me to give him a fish. What do you know, you're a natural coffee girl. That was fun fishing. No, it really wasn't. Be happy you missed it. Okay, um, it sure is, and it's useful too. You can set your fish at my stall as soon as we get it reopened, that is. Cool, thanks Goofy. Um, is he gonna ask me to fix this stall now? Gorsh, I guess it's a little more run down than I thought, but that's okay, Uncle Scrooge's construction company can fix it right up. You can use this sign to call him. Okay. Let's give him a call. Oh, greetings, neighbor. It's about time Goofy fixed this place up. I'm glad he's got you to help. Now, let's get down to business. 
Goofy can have this doll at no extra cost, since the valley needs it. But next time, I won't be as generous. What say ye? Um, yes, let's fix it. <laughs> Goofy's stall is now open for business. If you see another property you're interested in, don't hesitate to let me know. Simply go to the sign next to it. Okay, cool. Just, like... <laughs> I wonder if that means we can fix things up or what? Okay, be active in the valley, gather resources, sell what you don't need to Goofy stall and receive coin. Okay, that's easy to do. Now I can start getting some more money. And actually, I think I have some fish I wanna sell them. Thanks for everything, coffee girl. Finding my fishing rod, helping me fix up the stall. You're one great pal. Anything to help the village. Well, we sure appreciate it, Coffee Girl. In fact, here's a little something so you can help the valley even more. It's a free sample of some of the seeds I sell in the meadow. Ooh, cool. Thank you. Some lettuce, <gasps> some wheat, and some carrots. Cool. Thank you. I get new stuff at the stall all the time, so come on by anytime you, you like. In fact, you could even be an investor and help me make it eat even better. Then I could sell even more kinds of seeds. Cool. So we completed our quest with Goofy. And let's see, if you wanna become friends with someone, you just have to click I have something for you so you can become a friend. So let's see, Gorsh. We never had night thorns before the forgetting. Why do you think they showed up? I think they're attracted to negative emotions. They're probably a metaphor. They're just weeds. <laughs> you think? Well, at least we can get rid of them like weeds. Cut them down, dig them up, and make the valley safe for nicer plants. Play. Have you seen my pal? <laughs> oh, we have level two friendship. Okay, that's awesome. Okay, so... We want to unlock, and this your companion can find more crops when harvesting. Okay, so we want to be better at. F I wish I was better at fishing. Um, we'll do gardening. We're kind of taking on the gardening route right now. Okay, so max energy increase and rewards times one. Thanks, Goofy. Okay, so. Maybe I'll plant some more stuff over here because we have like all kinds of seeds and I don't want to waste them. So maybe we'll plant them. What do you think, little squirrely squirrel? So sometimes when you dig, you can get things that come out like if you dig in random spots. So you can get things that'll pop out um, like money or coin and sometimes you just get a pile of dirt so just so you're aware that you can still get stuff even though there's no like crack or, or in the ground or anything like that plant some wheat here because you know mickey wants us to plant some wheat and then we'll plant some carrots i guess and then lettuce we need lettuce Okay, the other lettuce, and then we're gonna water all these. And then we'll get our coin over here. So the last task that I wanted to complete before we go on is to talk to Merlin. I just need to make him my friend, and he's nowhere to be found right now. Oh. We have a completed quest for Scrooge. Let's talk to him. Good day to you. Well done, Coffee Girl. With Goofy back in business, you can make some money. Ah. Then, when you're ready to invest in my grand reopening, come find my sign next to Scrooge's General Store. Okay, let me see bye -bye, how much money he actually needs. Good day to you. Are you ready to invest? As soon as I open the shop, there will be all sorts of furniture and clothing to purchase. You can trust me on my, or my name isn't Scrooge McDuck. Oh my gosh, I need to pay him because I need a shop. Finally, the grand reopening. 
Oh yeah, we need some clothes for sure. I'm so excited. Bless me hand pipes. I'm back in business. All I need now are some customers. Oh, and a good investment deserves a good return. These coins are for you. Use them to get anything you like. Cool. Does that mean I get, oh, he gave me 400. So it's like I spent 600 on it. Come in, take a look around, copy girl. If you're not finding anything you like, talk to me in the shop to use my patented McDuck delivery system. Oh, cool. Okay, we're, we're going in right now. <gasps> I see a dress. Oh my gosh, look at that dress. I bet you I do not have enough money for that. That is so pretty. 800. The question is, is do you spend that much money? It's a Beauty and the Beast white and floral gown. Looking at this item, are you? White and pink floral gown, a fine acquisition for someone of good taste. Yes, yes it is. I need to see what else you have before I go spending $800 on a dress. Aye, but remember my stock isn't always the same. Thank you kindly. I think I need something to cook on too because Mickey wants to cook with me. I could have like a frozen throne over here. Mrs. Potts and Chip. What's over here? Oh, it's a crafting table. <gasps> a computer? Oh my gosh, a coffee machine. You know I want that. There's so many things I want. What's this, a game? That's pretty cool, it's an arcade game, but... Oh my gosh. So it looks like this is all that he has, unless he has something else that I don't see here. I think that the best investment is honestly a crafting table right now. Okay, so I can use this crafting table to make stuff, which is so awesome. So I can make myself a table if I wanted to. Um, I wonder what I need to make these. Let's see. Soil and stone. Oh, okay, that makes sense. So I have lots of stone in my in my inventory and then I just need some soil and then I can do that. And soil is easy to get, you just have to dig the ground. Mark me words. A villain and their okay, we have lots of dream bastard. shards at home. And what do you do with a purified night shard? I think you can buy things. Well, obviously you can, but still. Okay, so we know we can't buy that crafting table, but we can buy this dress over here. Okay, let's go buy the dress. I'm buying it. I have to, because oh, you know I want to look like neighbor. that. I want to look like that. Yes, I'm buying it. 800, <laughs> please. It's all yours and a very wise investment indeed. I agree. Thank you, so pretty. I'm assuming that the more money that you spend, like the better things that pop up like you'll probably be able to go upstairs eventually and buy stuff for whatever you know whatever is going to be up there i don't even know but let me see if i can get dressed in here Ooh, i can get dressed in here you guys so let's put it on oh my gosh i have to take my backpack off though because it looks kind of you know not so fabulous but i love it it's so pretty okay so for now we're going to take our ears off because I'm I'm just gonna play it up here. I love how pretty this dress is. And now I feel like a pretty pretty princess. Look at me. Oh my gosh, I love it. Okay, it looks like we completed another part of the task list on, with him. So let's see what he says next. Greetings, neighbor. An excellent investment, coffee girl. You won't regret it. Be sure to come back and look over my stock often. I get new things every day. Okay, we already know that. That's business. That's smart business. <laughs> of course it is. After all, I know how to keep my customers happy. I'm Scrooge McDuck. Good for you. Okay. Okay, we did complete the mission, so that's awesome. Hello. Copy girl, I just looked at my quarterly profits. Ouch, it's a disaster. I'm completely ruined. What's wrong? A wee bit of everything at the moment. The shop's open, but I've got no customers. If I can't, if I don't act fast, my fortune will be lost. What do you need? 
Well, first, we need a way to show the villagers of Dreamlight Valley that Scrooge McDuck is open for business. I can help you advertise. That'd be grand. I'd do it myself, but when folks hear the name Scrooge McDuck, they think pillar of the community. Oh. I can't be seen around the village like some kind of walking billboard. <laughs> Besides, that's why I've got you. Oh, gee, thanks. <laughs> All right, put together an outfit to wear around the village to promote my shop. Man, you I have to wear something to promote him. I want, I want to wear my dress. Okay, what if I buy this coffee pot? I mean, I can afford it. Greetings, neighbor. Looking at this item, Maria, espresso machine, a fine acquisition for somebody or for someone of good taste. Yes, yes it is, because I love the way coffee <laughs> tastes. It's so good. I feel, I'm like kind of mad because I just bought my dress and he wants me to wear his clothing. Let's do that a different day. So what we're going to do is we're going to complete the test, the task for um, Merlin and then we'll go ahead and we'll finish the video for today. So that way I get to wear my pretty, pretty dress for the rest of the video. So, you know, Scrooge has nothing he can say about that. Um, and let's go find Merlin. There he is. Okay, oh Merlin. God. We've got to talk. Splendid. The dream light is pulling in the depths of the well. <laughs> you now have enough dream light to repel the night thorns on the castle's door. We mustn't waste any time. Hurry, hurry. Okay, so <laughs> in order to not get to this point, through. we did have to complete a few tasks for Merlin, and one of which was become his friend. And like I said, the way that we had to become his friend is I had to gather... Um, I had to give him three gifts. And once you give him three gifts, then it starts the, the leveling for becoming friends. So that's what we did. And now we get to go meet up at the gate and go into the castle. All right, so it looks like Merlin met us here. I have no idea how he beat me here, but he did. Oh, oh, hello. The dream castle, what should I do with the dream light I gathered? You have enough dream light to repel the night thorns from the castle's entrance, bravo. Oh, but there's no time to waste. Proceed to the castle immediately and remove those night thorns. Okay. I have done better myself. Focus your magic on the night thorns, coffee girl. Oh, 2,000. Oh my gosh. We did it. Bravo, coffee girl. Bravo. Now we can finally enter the dream castle. Well, oh, I'm so now. excited. Oh, it's so pretty in here. There's going to be lots of things to do in here and lots of vines to get rid of. Oh, hello. I remember now, Coffee Girl. It's not what's inside the Dream Castle, it's who. When our ruler left and the forgetting took over the valley, some of us stayed while others decided to return to their realms. Each door before you leads to a different realm, a dream of their own world. The castle is full of doorways to other realms. Ooh, ooh, okay. Um, I'm excited to meet new friends. Oh, you'll find countless new friends behind these doors. Though I'm afraid they won't remember Dreamlight Valley, so it's up to you to find a way to bring them home. I see you have just enough Dreamlight left to unlock the first door. You must choose the first realm you want to step into. Oh, okay, so do we want to do the ocean with a demigod, which we all know is Moana? A restaurant with a great little chef, I think that might be Remy. Or a desolate planet with a shy robot, maybe Wally? I'm not sure. Um, I, li I really love Moana. I love Remy. I've, I've, you know, Wally's okay. <laughs> She's there. Um, which one do I want to do? Let's do Remy first. Okay. <laughs> and the chef you'll find works true magic with food. Chefs and wizards have a lot in common, you know? Once you step through the door, you'll arrive in another realm. Help those inside as best you can. Tell them about Dreamlight Valley and ask for their help. We'll need all your friends here to prepare for what's ahead. Okay, sounds awesome. All right, I see a little mouse there. All right, you guys, so thank you so much for watching. Um, we are definitely gonna be going into the next realm on our next video. So make sure to stay tuned for the Remy video. It's gonna be 
awesome. I'm so excited to meet Remy. And um, don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification button. Remember, everything you count so much. I love you all. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you guys next time. Mm -hmm.